Getty's back, back again, another day. It's Thursday the 23rd. Yes, I know you're 10% charged, but what is the date? Please tell me the date. It's Thursday the 23rd of April and it's 20 past 10. So this is the update of what it's all looking like. It's looking a little bit wild, a little bit crazy. These need to come off. Got some foil there, but everything's pretty much sorted not really i lie it's not this drawer i kind of just shoved a load of stuff in i found my stack of foils this has the gold foil leaf in it and then also rose gold coppery gold foil leaf and then silver so i popped that in there and i just shoved a load of other random stuff in there so i do need to sort that drawer out and then this drawer i shoved all my stickers in here something super exciting arrived today let's go find it these guys here so what they are and i don't have the like the full thing that i need for these which is kind of annoying they're these little plastic wallets that you put into a ring binder folder and i got size a5 and a6 and i have ordered ring binder folders for them to go in apart from the fact that i ordered them from aliexpress so they're going to take ages to arrive so i think they come in a pack of 12 i got these from amazon if i remember i'll pop them in a link in the description box down below for you but i got the two sizes and basically what i want to do is organize all of my stickers into here i've got all these stickers and i'm thinking i might organize them into gold stickers silver stickers florals all that kind of thing and try and separate them all out because there's some i've got some really nice ones i think i actually got these from urban outfitters in the uk how gorgeous are they and i just can't see what i've got and i want to sort them out so i shove them in there for now but i want to transfer them into here some things are starting to look neat like my polish wall is all nice and tidy which is lovely this is still empty because this is where all of my essence glitters are gonna go so all of my essence glitters are gonna live in those drawers hopefully they'll all fit but i need to film a video of organizing them and a haul because i have been buying lots of new essence glitters i'm gonna sort out those stickers now that's the next job i've been really busy today sourcing out youtube videos i've actually just posted a watch me work youtube video on the channel so that is now up so definitely go go watch it go watch it it's um a watch me work and i'll leave a link in the description box down below for you guys but yeah so it's now 20 past 25 nearly 25 past 10 so i only really want to spend half an hour on this max and then i want to try and chill out because i've been working all day today on that youtube video so yeah i'm really happy with how it's starting to come together in this corner actually i think it's going to look really good when it's all done and dusted I'm gonna use the A5 size. I really like these holders and they have the little zip bit on it. And you can just open it up and put them all inside here, which is really cool. So I've kind of color coordinated it, not really, but I kind of have. Putting all my gold in here and they fit really nicely. I just think this way, I know that if I want to pick up something with a gold accent and I need a gold accent sticker, I can just grab this out and kind of flick through what i've got in here or i could even take the whole thing out if i wanted to really quickly flick through like this so yeah i really quite like that i just want my i want the cases to arrive i want the little wallets to arrive so i think i'm going to do them in color it keeps them all neat and all organized <gasps> i love it already i think it's gonna make things so much quicker and easier
off for them probably happy with how they work actually i just can't wait to get the little folder i ordered a pink sparkly one because why not they did also have this clear black one which looks really nice and classy as well so maybe i'll actually order one of them I'm really happy with them i'll make sure i pop a link in the description box down below where i found them then obviously i've still got all of the smaller sizes that i can use now to store my decals in i think i think that's what i'm going to use them for anyway or i could totally store my striping tapes in there as well oh my gosh i've just realized I could put all my fabrics in a little booklet like this. I think that would be so much better because I kind of don't really like having all these fabrics loose in here. And below here as well, I've got a ton of other fuzzy fabrics. So it might be better to store them in a little book. Hmm. Hey guys, another day, another day of, I don't know what. It's currently half six and it is Monday the 27th, I think of April. I am going live on my private Instagram account for training in an hour, less than an hour actually. I'm out of breath, I've just been running around the house like a lunatic. And basically, yeah, I'm going live, doing a social media and photography live online private class. I need to get the salon ready because I'm gonna be sitting in here doing the live. My mum's gonna be in here as well, reading out the questions. She is my assistant. And currently, this is the state of the salon. So I was having a play around with some nail art designs that I'm gonna be teaching on a online live private workshop. And there's just mess everywhere. There's kind of stuff up there that needs to go away. The rest of the salon is pretty messy too, but that doesn't matter because that's all gonna be hidden because the camera's gonna be facing this way. I just need to sort this all out and put away all the products that are on the table. So I need to get on and do that quickly. So I thought I'd show kind of like a little time lapse of me doing it. It's kind of organization, I guess. This organization vlog, vlog, salon vlog, I don't really know what it is, is a little bit wild. I actually need to, what is that? Oh, I think it's my mum's drink for when we go live. I've done a little more organizing in my drawers down here that I think I will show you right now. So I just used, these guys right here are little boxes that I got from Hobbercraft here in the UK. They've got this nice like leafy print on the top and then spots on the bottom. And I just used the lids for them to put in here and they fit in the Alex drawers so perfectly just to kind of hold and condense all my bio sculpture pot colours together. It holds them together really nicely and it stops them moving around a lot. So they fit in there really nice and snug and I did it in both these drawers. So that's something that I did. That's a little bit of organization. And I'm gonna do a really, really, really quick speed clean. So, wish me luck. Hey everyone, it's actually a few days later now. It's Sunday the 3rd of May and it's one o'clock and I am just gonna be doing a little bit of reorganizing in these shelves. I want to, cause I use this as a kind of like a backdrop for filming. I have to use my swivelly stool and pump it up really high to be able to get like the top area in for filming. And I just kind of want to be able to sit at a normal level. So what I want to do is move these three, no, these four polish shelves down a row to here and then move basically everything down. I want to kind of reorganise and resort these shelves because I've got some new apre inks that I want to be putting up on display on the shelf with the other ones down there. So I need to have kind of like a little reshuffle.
Okay, so this is what it's looking like now. I've got all my sherry inks at the top there, then all my Biosculpture gels, and then on the bottom there, I've got the Apre inks, which is nice because I've got room to grow for the Apre and the Biosculpture. And then also, if I need to, I've got a couple more shelves down at the bottom here so I can expand. But yeah, I'm really happy with that. I think it looks really nice and smart. I've got some more of the Biosculpture regular nail varnish coming, and I think I'm gonna put them underneath here, or I'm gonna have this whole section here of Biosculpture regular nail varnish. I'm not really sure, haven't decided yet. So when they arrive, I'll sort that out. So it's another day and I'm not in the salon right now. So that's new. This lockdown weirdness is just messing with my brain. My routine is all over the place. It is Tuesday the 5th of May now, quarter past six. No, it's the fifth. Uh -huh. He's tricking me. Nick's there. Say hi, Nick. Good evening. Wait. <laughs> it's a new day of organising the salon. It's taking a while, I'm not going to lie. But I have got... Do you mind? I'm trying to vlog. I'm washing up. <laughs> I'm going to go into the salon because it's a bit noisy out here. So I have had something exciting arrive. So, oh my gosh, the salon is still a bit of a mess but by the end hopefully this vlog it will be super clean and tidy that is the goal so let me just turn the light on these guys arrived they are what i ordered from aliexpress they're like a magenta pink with holographic glitter in them you can actually see them really cool there so i got the two different sizes for the folders that i bought that you saw me put these stickers in so i'm so excited they arrived actually really quick because aliexpress normally takes like can take like three four weeks to arrive but i think these took around one to two weeks so that's pretty good considering we're in lockdown as well so I've got these and I need to organise all the stickers that I put into the wallets into these. I haven't used the smaller size yet so I can leave that to the side for now. But I do need to sort out this folder and put all these guys in. But first I just need some bread and hummus. Bread and hummus. Time for hummus and snacks. Yes. Whilst we organise, oh, these are yes. all of the polishes that I need to sort out. So I've got them all over here. So they need to go into the other room and be organised. And my battery is flashing at me, so I'm going to change my battery, eat snacks, and I'll be back. Change of plan, we're actually going to take the dogs out for a walk. We've got Arthur and Beatrice here, and we're just going to take them out for a walk before I carry on in the salon tidying. Yeah, so we're going to go out, walk the dog, have a nice time. Nick, have you got poo bag? and I'll see you back in what will be a couple of seconds for you but a few minutes well about half an hour an hour for us and um, I'll continue to vlog the salon and organization Okay, back from the walk. Nick's just bringing through all of the polishes I've got to organise. I think I'm just going to organise them into colour on my table first. <gasps> ah! Okay, pop them down on the table here. Thank you. Oh my god, what? Oh, Mish is in here. Mish! Hi! Mish! Hello! Hi! She looks grumpy. Oh, are you coming to say hello to Mish? Yeah, we like Mish, don't we? Mish is our friend. Yeah, you love Mish. You love her, don't you, BB? Yeah, I know. Right, so all of these polishes, I'm gonna color organize them on the table first, and then I'm gonna take everything off those shelves there, clear it already up, already up, I don't know how to speak, and then I'm gonna put these up. So they're all, in colour order, kind of. I'm not very good at colour organising things. So I mean, I've, I've done my best. So now I need to clean this off and remove all the polishes. And then I'm going to sort, oh, oh, bad move, Izzy, bad move. I'm gonna sort them all out and colour organise them on these shelves. I wanna give them a little dust off first. And I'm also going to put some under there. We also still need to organise this and sort that out. So actually, I might do this first. Yes, 
Pause, let's fix this. Guys, guys, look at it. I love it. So cool. And to be fair, this is a bit bit like little girly with the whole pink and the sparkly. They did have a like unicorn mermaidy one, and they also did have a clear kind of black glass one. But yeah, I thought this was quite cool. I might get the other colours as well. And I've definitely got growing room in there, so I could add another folder. So I'm gonna pop that down the side there. I think that's where it's gonna live. And yeah, I think I think that's okay down there. Nice and tucked out of the way. And then I have all my little mini decals back there too. So that looks good. I've put my colours in the back two rows there. The top row is really good. You can see it really clearly. The only thing is the bottom row. You can't see it too well. It's just a shame that they're a bit hidden. I'd love them to be more on show. What I could do is put all the polishes on the shelf like this. But then you don't see the beautiful full colour of the polishes. So I don't know whether I should just combine this row and this row together and put it on the top like this or not. And then I do have these polishes. These ones are doubles, but I do have these polishes still to go on a shelf. And I think I'm gonna take these foils off this top shelf here and put the polishes there. Cause I really want this area to be super colorful and be another backdrop for filming videos. Right, it's all done, all organised, all sorted. I flipped those around and I'm actually really happy with how they look. I think it looks quite cool. And then I've got the blues up there and... <coughs> Bless me. I now need to sort out where I'm putting these bits and bobs. So what I thought is I've actually got a spare drawer up here. I've actually got two spare drawers, although I have got more of these inks coming that I will probably fill this drawer up with. Although they could actually go in this drawer with my striping tapes really couldn't they so i'm going to try and take my book of gold leaf out so so delicate this is from amazon i'll try and leave a link in the description box down below for anyone who wants to get their hands on it it is just a book full of gold leaf copper rose gold leaf in the middle and then the silver leaf on the bottom which you can't really see but yeah it's a whole book i will literally never run out of this in my life i'm still on the first sheet i wonder if i could fit my foil book in the top still because it's a good place for me to reach because i use it a lot it's just so delicate i don't want to end up breaking it i might pull the drawer out completely actually does not quite fit i wonder if i could move these up and make some space that way yeah, that works. I can leave it in the drawer like that. That works. Can I cope with the way that looks? And then I've also got these glitter trays that I just pop on the top of the foils to hold it down. Because otherwise the sheet can like fly free and it's a bit frustrating. Okay, cool. Yeah, I'm happy with that. That can be my extra glitter and then also my foils. I can now actually put back my set of drawers that I'm going to be using for my... Oh, gosh. This is actually really heavy. I probably shouldn't be picking up with one hand. This is what I'm going to be putting my essence glitters in. And I need to film that video, actually. And I might film it tonight. It is already almost 10 past 10. But 
at least I have made progress. I'm really happy with the progress I've made actually. It's starting to look really nice and I think it will look really cool as a background for my videos. The only thing I need to sort out to do with is these guys here. So I might, as I said, put them underneath at the back here or should I put them maybe like that on the back? I'm not sure, I feel like that's a bit clustery or maybe I'll put the ethos range up here. That might be okay. I could probably fit them all along the top row here. Let's see, let's see, let's see. That looks all right. And then I've got all my base and top coats, um, all my contour base and top coats, my Evo range. So I don't know where to pop these guys. They might have to go in this drawer here. But I don't know where, because I like to have my brushes laid out nice and smooth. And then I've got all my tools in here. All my little palettes and bits and dobs there. Chewing gum, we all need chewing gum. My little brush crown, my forms and my bio gels and some tools, spider gels and my gel art paint. So I don't really have room in here to put them unless I put them down the side here. I'm not sure if they would fit in here. Let me see. Oh, they do fit. Let's just fill up this side and see if the drawer will close. They might hit the top. Oh, they fit perfectly oh my gosh i'm so happy i'm gonna go through and just make sure because i know i've got a couple of doubles in here like i can see there's a, a double there i'm gonna go through and just check what i've got in here and put some in a drawer if i don't need them all but yeah that fits perfectly and it's really easy access for me to just grab them out that's all nice and organized and sorted now so i'm happy with that and that can just live there and then i think i'm done with the organizing for now i hope you've enjoyed this video i mean it's been a bit all over the place and the fact that i've had to split it into two parts as well shows how much i'm obsessed with organizing because i'm a little bit obsessed with it but yeah it's now 10 past 10 my makeup is definitely starting to come off now and my hay fever is getting worse i don't know why my hay fever gets worse in the evenings so i'm gonna sign off from this studio organizing organization lockdown vlog style video thank you so much guys for following me along and joining me on this process i hope you are all well sending all my love through the camera to you at home no matter where you are in the world i hope you're all doing great and yeah thank you so much for watching i will see you in my next video and yeah don't forget to like and subscribe and hit that notification bell if you want to be notified when i upload a new video and yeah i'll see you in my next video bye guys